Hi guys, I have a short haul video for you today. I got some paper from Imagines. It is their perfect vacation line. And the reason why I got this paper is because, well, of course, because it's cute, but also because I am going on vacation later this year. So I'm gearing up. Um, I know I'm going to be taking tons of photos. So um, I happened to be at the craft store and I saw that they had this paper and I just had to get it because I love how it looks. I love the designs and the colors. So I picked up a, a couple of sheets. So that's the back. And then I've said before that I, I love geotags. I don't know what it is. I, I love geotag designs. So I saw this and I had to get it. And that's the back. I got two of these because I thought I could uh, cut them down, um, cut the sheets down for Project Life journaling cards. Um, I'm not quite sure yet what I'm going to do. Um, I got, I thought I could cut up one and then use the second one for a 12 by 12 layout. So I got this one here, and that's the back. And this one here. Oops. Then we have some dots on the back of that one as well. And then some airplanes. And then this one here. So that's the pretty, pretty paper that I got recently. And then I also got these Distress Ink Markers by Tim Holtz. And there was a gal on Facebook that was selling these and um, they were brand new. And I don't have these colors and I thought they were really pretty so I got these from her. This is Peacock Feathers and Squeeze the Lemonade. And I have a couple other markers. Um, I haven't even had a chance to play with them yet but you know she was selling them really cheap so I figured I'd go ahead and pick those up from her. And then I got my paper tray ink order and you know I rarely ever buy anything from them. I love their stuff. It's just I don't love their prices. So that's the reason why I normally, um, if anything, you know, I'll buy from people who are de-stashing on Facebook. And that would be people who are, you know, downsizing and getting rid of some of their stuff. So they sell their stuff at discount because, you know, maybe it's used. And anyway, um, that's what I would normally do. But I saw this particular set on their website and even though I had to pay full price for it, I just had to have it because I am going to New York City later this year for the very first time and I'm super excited about that. So I thought I would get this set and make some cards for my friend that I'm visiting because he loves to send out cards. And I thought I could make some cards for him and also use these for some Project Life cards for myself. And I just love that there are so many different stamps in this set. So that's that. And then, you know, it was actually sold out when I first saw it. And I went on the wait list. And thankfully, it didn't take very long. It wasn't even, gosh, I would say maybe a week and a half. And it was restocked. So I jumped on it and purchased it. Same day I got the email notice. And I'm so glad that I did. Here's the, the coordinating die set. And then they also had this set here for $5. It is the City Scene Christmas Sentiment stamp set. And you know, there are sayings on here like sidewalks dress in holiday style and it's Christmas time in the city. Santa Claus is coming to town and there is a cute Santa with reindeer. And I just thought it was just too cute to pass up so that's that and then I also have a hostess set um, from Stampin' Up! it's called Good Greetings and you can see all the different sayings and I actually got this for free as a demo because I you know there was like a little sales thing going on last quarter and because I satisfied the criteria for that little contest I was able to get this for free but it is a hostess set, so if you are thinking of hosting a party, this is something that you can look at as a, um, an incentive. Okay guys, the next thing I have is my Studio Calico order. And what is today? Today is, okay, hold on, it's two in the morning here. Saturday, 
okay, so I got this yesterday, which is Friday the 8th. Yes, Friday the 8th. And um, I'm really happy because I'm all the way in Hawaii. And for some reason, it seems like I get my... Um, my kit earlier than some people on the mainland. Um, I'm not sure how it worked out that way, but I am glad that I don't have to wait too long to get mine. <laughs> so um, I'm very happy. But here's the new packaging, guys. Um, I don't. I you know I do like it. I do kind of also miss the older style packaging that was more durable. But I think the whole point is that when you're done with this, it's just easier to break down. And, hold on. This is a trouble when you have nails. It's hard to pick up things sometimes. Okay, here we go. So, this is a really cute package, though. Hold on. Here we go. It reminds me of, a, like, a little pastry box. Like, maybe there should be some macarons in here or something, you know? <laughs> but, um... It's dirty enough. Well, of course, it comes in the other... If you're familiar with the packaging from Studio Calico... You get your kit in, um, sent to you in a different box. So it's not like they send it to you just like this. But it's sturdy enough to keep your stuff inside and to reuse if you wanted to. And I thought this makes this would make a really pretty um, box for wrapping a gift. Well, anyway, let me show you the contents. Now, normally... Um, if anything, there's washi tape, but I think these are actually stickers. And again, sorry, I'm having the nail problem. Um, but I think these are stickers, guys. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they are. And I'm just a little surprised at that because I'm used to getting washi. And not that I care that it's not washi because these are this is so cute. But I was just a little surprised at that. And then we have these. Hold on. Sorry, I, I get really... Sometimes I get annoyed when people make the, that loud crinkling noise with their packages in their videos. So I try not to do that when I open stuff. But sometimes you can't help it, right? But anyway, look at this. This is so cute. It says, love you two pieces. And they are these wooden veneers. And I just want to see if these... Oh, this one says, best day yet. XOXO. And this one says, morning. And then what else do we have here? I already opened um, the cards and I'll show that to you in a little bit. These are some die cut shapes. I'm not going to open the package. And then um, plastic tabs. So from what I recall, these are like the little tabs that you would put on um, the edge of your folder or whatever. And then you would put the um, little... Uh, words there in the plastic like index tabs yeah something like that and then there's this little envelope here and then we have a package of these um, labels they're not adhesive or anything so but I love that they're already cut out for you because normally you can buy the um, the digital file and print these out yourself and then cut them but you know I love that they're already cut for you so I don't have to fuss with that and here's the stamp set for the month and it's okay I'm not really thrilled about it but um it's okay so <laughs> moving on here's the alpha stickers I don't there's not even a brand name or anything so, I don't know. I'm not sure how I feel about that bright metallic silver. Okay. Oh, before I forget, let me, um, oh, you know what? Let me just finish this. I got these cards here, and I love, love, love the cards from this month's kit. I don't know why I really love this one here, even though this, you know, I, I live in Hawaii, and this doesn't look very Hawaiian, but... I love it anyway so that's that one and then school supplies every book is a new adventure and I love this because we go to the library at least every other week and we 
borrow tons of books at one time. This is cute. There's a little mug on the back. Live fully, tell your story, repeat. I think that little boy is from the October Afternoon line. The um, library, I can't even remember what it's called. Oh, I love this one. Books and coffee. Two of my favorite things. So I absolutely love that card. World's Greatest. Oh, on the other side it says world's worst. Today's headlines, currents and reading. Hey, awesomeness. Just a note. Here's the little girl. Oh, what a beautiful morning. Oh, what a beautiful day. Good stuff right here. And then we have the four by sixes here. And I, I think this is probably, these cards are probably my favorite so far. Shine bright. My brain has too many tabs open. This is so me because I'm always doing many, many things at one time. Okay, so that's that. And I was able to pick those up. Okay, so that's the kits. And I want to show you the other things that I got this month. I got from Studio Calico. I ordered the American Crafts Precision Pen and the point five and point well point zero five and point zero three. And you know, I'm still on the hunt for the a pen that I like writing with for Project Life. And I haven't tried those yet, and I'm hoping that I like them because I'm tired of hunting for the right pen. So anyway, the last thing I wanted to show you is I got some tags from Studio Calico during their last call sale. And I don't know, they were like a dollar, a dollar something. They were really cheap. So I got a bunch of them because I do love their tags. So I got this, um, the large one in white. And then the different sizes, medium and small. And then I got, I just want to show you guys the color. Here we have blue and green. And you know, I decided I'm not gonna take the rest out because of the, the crinkly noise. And um, this one's red. And I'm so glad I was able to get yellow. I wanted the different sizes, but they were sold out already. So I got this bright yellow, which I love. And I think, yep, I've shown you everything that I've gotten this week. So. Anyway, um, if you guys have any questions on anything, leave a message and I will get back to you. Thanks for watching, guys.